We go now to a tiny restaurant in rural Kaohsiung, where the traditions of Taiwan's military cuisine are kept alive. Military dependence villages were set up for the KMT troops and their families in the 1940s. They couldn't use open fires, so they developed a special cuisine based on gentle methods like steaming. A stewardship program is encouraging Kaohsiung residents to move into the old villages and take care of the historical buildings. One woman to answer the call is Lü Jingjing. Along with her husband, she has opened a cozy traditional eatery in an old complex first built by the Japanese army. An egg wrapper is filled with seasoned minced meat to create a handmade egg dumpling, this restaurant's specialty. A special sauce is poured onto this cabbage, followed by egg dumplings. They simmer until tender and full of flavor. This dish is another customer favorite, fermented tofu and pork cheek. This is the place for authentic Shanghainese cuisine. We love the environment here in the old military dependence village because my husband's parents used to live in one. And so Kaohsiung city government is running a stewardship program for military dependence villages. And that gave us the chance to come and live in a Japanese dormitory for a general or a high-ranking officer. Lü Jinjin has always wanted to live on a small bit of her own land far from the madding crowd. Now this small eatery is tucked away in Huang New Village in Kaohsiung's Fengshan District. The Japanese dorm, decorated in traditional style plus wholesome home-cooked food, make customers feel relaxed and cozy. It's a very special restaurant and a very pleasant atmosphere. The residents of military dependence villages developed their own cuisine, adapting to the ban on open fires in the villages. Most dishes are steamed or stewed on an electric hot plate. Sour Chinese mustard greens is one of the best love recipes, which Lu pickles by hand. Space is limited in the cozy eatery, so booking is essential. But a banner above the door invites neighbors to come in and be welcome anytime.